In this video, I'm going to be walking you through three steps of how to craft a powerful growth partner offer that can make you 100K in just one deal. So we're going to start with selecting a niche, a type of individual who you are going to help and support to grow their business. This person needs to be the CEO or the business owner. And I would highly recommend, unless you have a specialist offer that works for a certain type of size of organization, preferably larger, I wouldn't go with anyone less than 10 employees within their business because it's likely that they have product market fit, cash flow to fund you as a growth partner. They need to be able to grow their business and afford to be able to pay you at the start. And you don't want to be working on a performance only deal. So we need to work with mid-sized companies. I would sort of say these are small to mid-sized, between 10 and 50 employees and they actually have to own the business and you want to be interested or have experience within the market that they're in. You know, so some of these might be, you know, Microsoft software companies, they might be car garages, they could be medical companies, they could be you know, organizations that you have some experience in that you've worked in or interested in. But I would highly recommend selecting organizations that have business owners, business owner operated, it's their money, they're investing into it, they can make decisions quite quickly and effectively, and they have enough revenue to be able to afford to bring on team members. That's the type of size of organization and type of characteristics that I would look for when I'm selecting my niche. And then you can start to segment in multiple different other ways in terms of, you know, geolocation, the types of software they use, etc. And let's remember, with a growth partner deal, you only need five to 10 clients to make a significant amount of money. You don't have to have a market which is B2B SaaS that has tens of thousands of companies. What we want to do is we want to niche down to a specific type of business owner that you're comfortable in, that you understand, that you know, that you like working with, and you want to help them to grow exponentially. Now what we need to do is audit your skills and experience. So what this will do is it will allow you to start to understand what you can actually deliver and how you can actually deliver and why you are the best person to deliver this. So what I want you to do is get an A4 bit of paper out. You know, I, I would recommend handwriting this out so you can be a bit more sort of creative and you're not thinking that you need to write straight away and write everything that you could do to help that specific business and individual grow their organization. You know, go for 20, 30 things that you could do. So pause the video, do that now. Once you've done that, I want you to now take that list and look at the three to five top ones that you think would really move the business forward. And we wanna use the 80-20 principle on this. So what are 20% of the things that you can do that will give your partners 80% of the results? A lot of the time what we wanna to look to do is around how we create new opportunities for them and then and or close those opportunities. Now let's get those three to five things that you can do that will help them to grow. Once we have those three to five things, what we want to do is create something that's different to your competitors, okay? So we need to have a slight edge, a slight difference, a different way of doing things. So a lot of people have a lead generation business, okay? So they say, we'll come in, we'll get leads for you. They put email campaigns up, send email campaigns. They don't get fantastic results, etc. So instead of doing that, you could do lead generation. But as an example, you could do multiple other things to support on that. And that could be, you know, collecting case studies beforehand, you know, creating those case studies for them, writing out different specific type of claims, doing some consultancy to help them to craft their offer. You know, so yes, you're still gonna do that lead generation, but you're doing things beforehand to set them up to do that different and better for everyone else. So when you present your plan to them, which is the next step, then they will actually see that you're different from another agency. So select the niche, audit what you can do and what you can do differently. And then what we want to do is combine it into a done for you offer, okay? So we're in this crazy world where everyone just wants to make everything super efficient, make money for doing nothing, and that rarely works. Majority of the people that I know who have made money have actually delivered a service first, and then they might scale, you know, with info products, SaaS products, etc. But they've normally done a service-based approach, whether that's working for someone or doing a service based to their clients. So if you're at that, you know, five to 15K a month, et cetera, and it can be a little bit higher, maybe a little bit lower, what we wanna do is a done for you offer. And what that will enable you to do is really hone in on your skill set, to learn a significant amount, and to then be able to package them and scale at a later date. When we're presenting this done for you offer, what we want to do is develop a custom plan that actually addresses their needs. So we're actually building almost like a roadmap for them and we're providing value as we present that. Once we've 
understood our niche and we start to build our value proposition, what we want to do is not just to write out, you know, we're going to do lead gen, we're going to build a funnel, blah, 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 blah. But actually look, over the 12 months, how can we get our client from point A to point B? And we're going to put a plan together to show them the journey, you know, and most people aren't doing that. So when you actually present this to a potential prospect or client, they're like, wow, this is, you know, this is excellent. You know, they can actually see and receive value from the sales process. And we do that in every single one of our proposals and propositions, and we have it templatized, but we add a lot of customization to it. And that brings a huge amount of value to the clients. And with this done for you offer at the start, you should be able to deliver to three to five clients with a couple of VAs, leveraging technology and software that you would have maybe used or can learn online pretty easily. Deliver that over a 12 month contract and your profit margins will be about 80% if you present this correctly and you will be able to deliver to a small amount of clients and give them significant service so they get time with you, they get time with the team and you really build out that value proposition on that high value white glove service for the done you offer. And yet again, we can customize this, optimize it at a later date, but this is what will get you to 100K. If you want to find out a little bit more about how we do this and how we support people to do this, please book a call below and me or a member of my team be happy to walk you through it, learn a bit more about where you are, where you want to be, and to see if we can support. Thank you.